Oh, look at that. Aaron Marshall has sent me a challenge video. Oh god, I hope it's nothing too complicated. Hello. You might remember these from season... It's still lagging. You might remember these from season one of your videos. This is your favorite pair of scissors, and I have kidnapped them from you. Oh no! So, Teo, if you want to get them back, you're going to have to participate in my challenge program. Oh. What is my challenge? Well, in the past of your channel, you have made a program to help you with Uno. Now I thought, well, ha 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 ha, what if you do a different game? A different, more old game. A less known game. The game is Trivial Pursuit. Huh? No, no, I'm not, no, not Trivial Pursuit. I wouldn't do that to you. No, no, no. But, but what, what, but what if, what if you did, you did Life? Huh? That, what about that game? A game of life? Uh, how about Clue? Huh? Main idea. Okay, 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 okay. I know, I know, I know. Nobody likes the intro screen. I've seen the audience retention data from my previous videos. And like I said, every new video needs to have some improvements compared to the previous one. So, to keep myself organized this time, I made a list here with all the things that I gotta fix in this video. Issue 1. Respect your audience's time. Remove everything from a video that has nothing to do with the main topic. God damn it! Alright, time for the code! Uh... Wait, what's the video about? Ah, oh, yeah, that's right. Hey, look at this! I finished the code like uh, four weeks ago and uh, I don't really remember how it works anymore. Let me help you with that. So, to keep things simple, all the program needs to do is to keep track of other players' cards and then inform me how many cards are there left, what cards each player has, and how many of each type, meaning how many weapons, suspects, and rooms each player has. And so that way I can more easily keep track of who has how many each types of cards. And most importantly, I can more effectively decide what could be the free secret cards. Basically, it does the same thing as the detective has no cheat, only just slightly less organized and harder to read, which is overall kind of useless and uh, makes me want to die. This is so stupid, I don't want to do this anymore. And here's the code! Finally, Jesus Christ. Now, I know not everyone knows how to code, so I'm gonna keep this very brief and very simple just to, you know, just to give you a little hint of what programming is kind of like. All right, now, all right, now, now, the best way to explain this to, now, the best way to explain this to you is basically, how would you actually make a program that, you know, keeps track of other players' cards and, mm -hmm. you know, uh, as you know, in the standard clue rules, we have two to six players, so each player must... Uh, so for each player, we must know what cards... Yeah, it didn't go well. Editing this into something that makes sense would be a total waste of time. So I got a better idea. Voice over. Basically, here's the summary. The basic logic of the code is that each player is listed with two lists. One for storing the names of all the cards, and the other for storing the exact amounts of suspects, weapons, and rooms. Here's how. Enter how many players are in the game. Space for each player has revealed the cards. Do some simple checks to make sure that players selected actually exist. In the while loop, enter cards one by one to a list of a specified player. Instead of typing in the full name of the card, because that's doo doo, it is simply done by entering a number that corresponds to a specific card. Which was totally a genius idea. It made my life much easier. Do some checks, do this, do that, take a shit, and voila, we're done. And now let's see how past Theo has actually explained this part. And we're done! Only uh, 246 lines of code. Probably could have done as much less, but uh, I don't really care about you know, optimizing and stuff. Uh, anyway, let's go ahead and test out the code. So first of all, there are some bugs, but as long as I'm careful, uh, this shouldn't be a problem. Okay, so if you start up the code and to ask us how many players will play the game, uh, in this case, you know, there's only gonna be two players, because uh, I mean, I, I don't have many friends that are willing to be, you know, filmed for a YouTube video, just, you know, for playing the game, so. And now it asks us, type which player has to reveal its cards. So in this case, I am the player zero, because that's just, you know, the easiest. You press enter, and then it asks us type what card was shown. And in this case, well, uh, let's say it's an, uh, a suspect four. Well, we need to know which uh, on which place in the list this card is. And in this case, it's pretty easy because it's we just count here zero, one, two, three, and so we know it's card three. So we type in three, enter, 
And then we also enter all the other cards that we have. So let's take card 9, card 12, card 15. And then once we're done, we press enter. And there you go. We have a suspect, uh, oh, sorry, uh, player 0 has uh, suspect 4, hall, playroom, rope and bedroom. And right here we have room and web. We have one suspect, three rooms and one weapon. And there's all the other remaining cards. So yeah, so that we can, you know, uh, guess which cards, which one of the cards could be, you know, the three, six, the three secret cards. Oh my God, I'm feeling this for a fifth time. I cannot get this. Anyway, yeah, that's pretty much it. So now I think it's time for me to reveal the game, game board. We got them software running on my computer. We got them webcam number one. We got webcam number two. We got piece of shit gla plexiglass. We got we got the lamp. We got num lamp number two. We got lamp number three. We got oh two lights here. Uh, it's still not bright enough. It still looks like shit. We got them keyboard. I want to use a wireless keyboard, but the USB Wi-Fi it it killed my internet. I don't know. There's there's just so much stuff here. I am so tired. I just cannot wait for this thing to be over. This this has been. Uh, a nightmare to set up. However, there's one small minor issue. I, it's not really an issue. Uh, it's just um, it's just the fact that um, the game. It, it's in Croatian. Ah. Yeah. But there's there's pictures, right? Yeah. What I'm pretty sure you're gonna be having trouble with is probably the names because I mean, like, can you can you pronounce this? Uh, yeah, yeah, I can see. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, I can it's see. It's also that. the text. It, it's like also the text style. Yeah, like yeah. It's really two hours later. Okay, so this is definitely the first game we're playing right now, just for the recording. So yeah, 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 yeah absolutely. Yeah, we totally you know? didn't try this already, and it went like horribly slowly. And Okay, I have to think of some, we have to think mm -hmm. of some high, because because the, the video so far, right, is high, high energy, so. I'm just going to cut this part, because, you know. <laughs> yeah, I, I just, I pretty much realized after saying we mm -hmm. have to make it high energy, that yeah. there's no way that <laughs> yeah. it's high energy. So here's the list for my viewers, this is the list of our cards, so every time I need to enter a specific cards, get entered the, the corresponding number, so yeah, that's, I don't know if I mentioned this earlier in the video. Honestly, I players two players. Type which player revealed the card is player zero is me. And uh, card, let's see, it's this. This is only the most high quality content. Right yeah, here. we are the the next gen big YouTubers. We're gonna have millions of subs, and everyone's gonna love us, and everyone's gonna talk about us. And we gotta review every other channel that's trying to be in the same niche yeah. as us and just tell them everything they're doing wrong just yeah like just, just, <laughs> ro just roast them like boo you don't know how to, how would... to do cuts what is this where's the j cut dude eventually so i accuse the red person hallway with with a knife so red person okay. knife hallway now i should Show the cards, right? Yes. If okay. That's your... Yeah. All right. Okay. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and just say this now. Uh, I I have the red person. Oh crap! Well, <laughs> you you've you've ruined the anticipation. <laughs> oh. no, 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 actually, cut this out. Cut the cut that out. Uh, oh, Should I cut this it? out? Oh my gosh! <laughs> Oh my gosh, <laughs> who who is it? Is it just gonna be right? <laughs> is, it, is it gonna be wait, right? Wait, wait, wait. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Let's... Oof, the moment of truth. Who could it be? So I guessed wrong. Great. It is the the purple guy. Yeah. Is that the I purple the guy? Dagger. Let's see. I I guess I I knew it was the dagger. So it was. And I life. knew it was between the yellow. Oh, it was the hallway. And blue person. Oh, it was the hallway. Damn. And I knew it was between the kitchen, study hall, and lounge. Damn. Oh. Oh well. I guess I'm out, just out of luck. Yep, that's uh, that's the video. So uh, I guess I'm supposed to make some sort of conclusion for the end. Uh... Hmm. In conclusion, shit idea zero out of ten, and I'm never doing it again. 
Thank you for watching. Oh, I also make sure to check out this video from Henry Marshall. It's real good. I can promise you that. Oh, and also, if you like this video, well, please, please leave a like. It will mean literally everything to me. And for the next video, I've got a much, much better idea. Thank you.